Hi, my name is Elaine Williams. I am founder of the Fix Your Love Life Coaching Program. And today's quick tip, I wanna to talk to you about expanding your receiving muscles. You know, so many of the women I work with, 40s and up, we have been, we've had to be go-getters. We've either had to be the main wage earner or it's a single mom thing, or just a lot of times, you know, when I first moved from Texas to New York, I had to completely change um, I was kind of laid back and you know you have to really hustle to make it on the East Coast and so I kind of had to like rev up I already had a type A personality but I kind of had to rev it up in other ways and, and learn how to work faster and hustle and kind of get through the crowd to get to where I was trying to go in New York blah 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 and I found that a lot of women I, I work with have have had to kind of step into that sort of masculine go 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 energy and so one of the greatest gifts I get to do is help women kind of take a breath and start practicing receiving again. Because that is directly related to being in a healthy, happy partnership with a healthy, available guy. A man you don't have to take care of or rescue that doesn't mean there's not a give-and-take but I found so many of my clients have unconsciously fallen into they've been so busy giving and hustling and managing the kids and the and the career and all the stuff and even their parents and sometimes they end up sort of becoming almost like a mother to a teenage son that kind of relationship that's happened a lot in the past with with their past relationships and that's what they don't want so one of the ways to practice being in a partnership with a real man an available emotional partner is to practice your having a muscle and I it's kind of like working on becoming a queen again Instead of having to hustle and run, practice slowing down and allowing. So I love this concept and it's, um, you know, this is something that takes a little bit of practice. It's not something that you kind of do once. All right, I got it. Let's go. It's all about learning to slow down and allow. And there's a lot of trust involved in this. So that's another thing that I work on a lot with my clients. So my challenge to you is to think about where are you with your receiving muscle? Where are you with allowing things to happen? And coming from that grounded goddess place of allowing and receiving versus having to hustle and make things happen um, it's a different vibe it's a totally different vibe and it's something that takes a little practice so you know it's one of the reasons I work with people on starting to a meditation practice even if it's two minutes in the morning just breathing it doesn't you know you don't have to levitate tomorrow but where are you in this conversation and have you thought about that recently what is your having muscle your receiving muscle how are you at allowing things to happen and coming from a place of trust so I'd love to hear from you let me know what you think please leave a comment below I would love to connect further with you, so please make sure you're on my free blog and email newsletters at elainewilliams.com. Stay tuned for more stuff, and yeah, think about it. What can you allow to happen today? What can you receive from the universe or friends? You know, um, when you're moving all the time, it's harder to be able to receive, but what if you could stop and pause? what could happen then? Think about it. I'd love to hear from you. Thanks so much and have a fabulous day.